y'all, I've been waiting to do a follow-up of this story right here. I've been so waiting to do a follow-up of this. So good morning, good afternoon, all of y'all. Welcome to the Mental House with me, your host, Khadija. Um, and let's get right to it. Two charged in an alleged racist attack against in black Indiana man who claims men called to get a noose. Two men accused of an attempted lynching of a black man at an Indiana lake on the 4th of July weekend have been charged. Thank God, Monroe County Prosecuting Attorney Erica Oflian announced Friday. Because they were definitely going to hang him. I don't know if any of y'all, how many of y'all have seen that video where these two big look like WWE drunk sumo wrestlers were attempting to pull a, a, a young black man to his lynching. Uh, Sean Purdy, 44, was charged with criminal confinement, intimidation, and battery resulting in moderate bodily injury, while Jerry Cox, 38, was charged with aiding, inducing, or causing criminal confinement and battery resulting in moderate bodily injury. He, is also, he also faces misdemeanor charges of intimidation and battery. The victim, Von Booker, claims that he was attacked by five white men with Confederate flags who literally threatened to lynch me in front of numerous witnesses. At one point, the attack, one of the men jumped on my neck, the Booker, a Bloomington civil rights activist said, and a member of the Monroe Human Rights Commission, I could feel both his feet and his full body weight land hard against my neck. Booker also claimed that the attackers told people to get a noose. His lawyer, Kathy Lyle, said Friday the charges are the first step towards justice. The prosecution of these individuals is necessary to send a clear and unequivocal message that hate crimes and acts of violence are committed against men and women simply because of the color of their skin is not only illegal, but is morally repugnant. Von Booker is a proud black man who suffered unspeakable indignities at the hands of these violent, insane individuals. Thank you for somebody calling it out what it is. According to a report from the Indiana Department of Natural Resources, Booker had crossed into private property to get to his camping site, at which point Purdy told him to leave the area. The daughter of the property owner claims that Booker and several other people then approached her on her property and threatened her and presented himself as a county official, according to the Star, the woman ordered him off of her property several times. Purdy then allegedly tried to punch Booker and, with a group of other men, pinned him up against a tree. Purdy told police that he was trying to restrain Booker and wanted to stop it from happening. Lyle accused officials of trying to malign the character of Von Booker by even suggesting that he had committed a battery in any form that night. I'm so glad that these guys were charged. And all you, the video may not exist, um, but if you uh, type it in, you might find it. The guy's name was Vaughn, spelled pretty different though, V-A-U-H-X-X, -X, Rush Booker. And um, these yahoos who tried to lynch him. It's right there. And from the looks on their faces, they look drunk and they look like a lynch mob. All right, you guys, I'll see you in the next video.